You look very worried. Is everything all right? No, everything is not all right. There are so many things I'm worried about. The weather report says a big storm is coming. I have a big test tomorrow, and I'm not sure I'll do well. We're moving, and I don't know if I'll make friends. Wow. Those are certainly things that can make you worried. But it sounds like you really need to hear our memory verse for today, because God doesn't want you to stay so worried. I'm going to read our verse, Philippians 4, 6, from God's Word. Philippians 4, 6. Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Philippians 4, 6. Our verse is in the book of Philippians. If you think Philippians is in the Old Testament, make an O with your fingers. If you think it's in the New Testament, make an N with your fingers. Philippians is a smaller book of the New Testament in a section called the Epistles. An epistle is a letter. Philippians is a letter written by a follower of Jesus named Paul to believers in the city of Philippi. If you lived in Philippi, you were a Philippian. The Philippian Christians had many problems and worries in their lives, much like you and I do. Paul wanted to remind them how big God is and that he would take care of them. God helped Paul write the book of Philippians, and that is why we have it today. It is a part of God's true word, the Bible. Let's say our verse together again. Philippians 4, 6. Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything, by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Philippians 4, 6. Now let's look at what this verse means. Do not be anxious about anything. To be anxious is to worry a lot. Many things can make us worry, but this verse says, don't worry about anything. How is that possible? The next part gives the answer. But in everything by prayer and supplication. Everything means every part of your life. Do you see where it says what you should do instead of worrying? It says prayer and supplication. Prayer is talking to God. God wants his children, those who have believed in Jesus, to talk to him about everything, good and bad. Supplication is when you ask God for something. You can ask God for uh, something for yourself or for other people. With Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving is to be grateful to God for who he is and what he has done. When you pray, thank God that he will answer. And then when he answers, thank him for what he has done. Let your requests be made known to God. Paul is saying again, take the things that worry you to God. God is the one who is always there to help you. Whenever you are anxious, tell God about it. Thank him and trust he will help. Let's say the verse together again. Philippians 4, 6. Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything, by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Philippians 4, 6. You cannot know what will happen next in your life, but you can trust God no matter what. If you have trusted the Lord Jesus as your Savior, trust that God's plans are best. Word up! God's plans are good. Whenever you don't understand what God is doing, remember to say and pray. Say a verse like Philippians 4, 6 and pray to God. Thank Him that He loves you and knows all about what is happening to you and ask Him to help. Remember, you can talk to an adult you trust about any hard thing you are going through. God can use them to help. Remember too, trust that God's plans are best. God planned the way for you to become His child even though your sin could keep you separated from Him. Because God loves you so much, Jesus died on the cross and rose again for you. You can receive Jesus as your Savior and know that is part of God's good plan. Let's say our verse together again. Philippians 4, 6. Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything, by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Philippians 4, 6. Now we're going to play stop and go. When you see the go sign, say the verse. But when you see the stop sign, stop on that word until you see the go sign again. Ready? Philippians 4, 6. Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything, by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Philippians 4, 6. Great job, everyone. Let's do it again. Philippians 4, 6. Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything by prayer 
and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Philippians 4, 6. Awesome. Let's do it one more time. Philippians 4, 6. Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything by prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Philippians 4, 6. Great job, everyone. Remember to practice saying your verse this week.